What's up my little cat travelers and welcome back to another episode of another Eden side story. So today guys, um, we're going to do Nekoko part 2. I am sorry guys, I've been lacking an update um, with uh, the side episode. Um, yeah, so I mean life gets in the way. So I've been mostly playing another Eden and some other games, but I'm back guys. I'll try to do more uploads. I'm sorry guys, I'm really sorry I failed you. But that being said guys, we're going to do Nekoko part 2. And sorry about that guys, my cat made some noise. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're gonna start with Nekoko part 2. Um, yeah, so right about now. The cat shrine is dying. Nekoko's quest. There is a report that the usually peaceful cat shrine is suddenly facing a unprecedented crisis. What could, it, what could be the cause of this crisis? So, let's start it up guys. I'm excited. <clears throat> ah! Sure feels good, sure, sure feels good help today. And on top of that, no one you am out to do. And no, no one comes to pray, so I'll just sit around and chill all day. I guess this is a typo. <laughs> e I, oh no, wait, all right, never mind. Yeah, the same thing as you did yesterday. Ah, the day before yesterday, the day before, the day before, yesterday, the day before yesterday. Every day I am lazy. Come to think of it, how long has it been since I had anything to do? Hmm. Long enough that you, you know, long enough that you don't even remember? Ah, whatever. Life's more, life's more fun when you just spend your day basking in the sun. Meow. Problem. Big problem. Oh. Hey, cool, it's Otawa. I haven't given her a voice yet, but... Hey, Otawa, what's up? Otanya! Where have you been? You've been out of for a walk for like, how many days now? Nyahaha, <laughs> my bad. I just got so wrapped up in this... in the leaf down the Vermilion Road, I completely lost track of time. Alright, I forgot that you two know each other. More than just know each other, Mialdo. She's like a big sister to me. Yeah, something like that. Do you even realize how lonely I was? Sorry about that. And to make it up to me, you're gonna have to share some of yours, ben Benito of Izo. Sorry guys, my cat is meowing. <laughs> Nyahaha! <laughs> Never miss an opportunity for more food, do you, Nikoko? Meow! <laughs> you two are really close. Anywho, sorry to in a moment, but uh, what was the big problem of you, what you were shouting about just now? <gasps> I almost forgot! Nyaji just sent me this message to pass along to summarize. It's not good. What did you What did you say? Here, read it yourself. Meow. What do we have here? Save the cat shrine from total destruction. Destruction from what? No idea how I got this message, but it's definitely from Nyajin Nyajiro. How? It's been so peaceful lately. <gasps> we didn't we didn't do anything yesterday and did it before yesterday and did it before and did it before. I'm just a cat. I'm freaking lazy, alright? I like to do nothing. Leave me alone. Or the day before. <gasps> Wait! <gasps> what? Did she figure out what to do? Alright, I mean let's go. Yeah, evil has been steering. Has it? Under our very nose, Nyaldo, something even more evil than evil itself has been steering. Alright, what is it then? It's not like I defeat evil on a daily basis. Take a look at this, Aldo. You got two get. Okay, I got two dollars. I, I don't follow. 
That's it. Oh, the donation for this month. We got nothing out of the word dirt poor. I need to, again, you need to open an OnlyFans to make more money. That's it. That must have been what Nyanji was warning us about. Not total destruction, total bankruptcy. Bankruptcy. I'm more impressed that you know the word. If I, if, you know, if we're being honest here, we're in trouble, Yalo. Save the compliment for later. All right. Taking away back my money. We're gonna need. We're gonna need way, way, way more money if we're gonna keep up the shrine afloat. All right. All right, girls. At this rate, we may not even be able to feed the cat. All right. And if we can't feed the cat. No, I don't even want to think about it. No, 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 no. We're as good as done. What a world. What a world. All right. I mean, I get it. Calm down. How does this even happen? Also, I, I have way too much money. I could legit give you all guys my money. I don't mind. The cash run has never been this debt. Where did everyone go? This is the only place for the believer of the cat deity. It makes no sense for them to just stop coming all of a sudden. We were guaranteed all the wish on the Emma, so it's not like the people would just be mad at us either. Hmm, maybe we should go to town and see if we can find any clue? Great idea, Nyaldo. Let's head to Izana and see if we can find anything. Quest accepted! Alright, so seems to be a run of the mill money quest. Um, so far, seems pretty good. Seems pretty good, guys. Thank you for bearing with my voices. Um, need to, uh, voice acting, guys. Voice acting. Alright, so I need to go to Izina. Amazing, amazing town. It's pretty cool. I like, I like that place, actually. So, here we are. Do -do 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 -do. Dun -dun. I love it. All right, let's see what's the big deal and how we can get more dough. Let's get to investigating. Hmm. All we have to do is grab someone and take them back to the shrine, all right? Um, we can't go around kidnapping random townspeople. We're gonna get in trouble. Why don't we just go? You know, we just. We can talk to people, that, that's a thing. Sound easy enough. Okay, cat girls, talk to everyone you see. Go! Let's go, Otania! I forgot how cool she looked, though. She she, looked, she has a much of vibrant color. You there! I commend you to pray to the very... I commend you to pray at the very preferable and not at all in financial trouble, Catch Ryan! Mm -hmm, catch Ryan! Mm, never heard of it. Sorry, I got somewhere else to go. I am old and I sound like a man. A total bust. I don't get it. I've seen her at the shrine before. What does she mean? Never heard of it. Hmm. Could you just be that someone that look like a person you know? I mean, there's a lot of people that look alike. But I know that was her. Hey, now we're talking. That's the whole lady is always, who's always giving me a treat. What's up, Granny Snack? I haven't seen you at the catch run in a while. We all miss you, you know. Something wrong? Hello, the catch run. It sounds familiar, but I don't think I heard, I ever heard of such a place. Huh? Now that we're talking gods, how about Akurau? Now that's a god. Akurau? Hmm. He's a good god, a kind god. Grant any wish that you could possibly think of. Yes. Hey, wait, I wasn't done talking. Come back, old lady. Hmm, something's up. Everyone we, everyone we talked to seems to have this dead look in their eyes. Whoa! 
who and what is Akurahu anyway? Hmm. Akurahu. Hmm. You heard of them? Nope. Oh. You know, because it, it kind of sounded like, all right. Anyway, completely ignoring the reincarnation of the cat deities will not be tolerated. We need to find out who this Akurau is and get to the bottom of this. That's exactly what I was going to say. Meow. But with everyone acting all weird, how are we supposed to find out anything? Good point. Hmm. Hmm, that's strange. Everyone is leaving town. Strange indeed. It is as if they're being mind controlled or something. Well, well, it looks like they're heading for the Ina, I, Inana Eri Plateau. So why don't, don't we follow them? All right. Let's go to the I, Ina Ina Nari Plateau. The uh, the actual like monster or whatever sounds like a Crash Bandicoot um character. Aku Aku. Yeah. All right. Let's see. So yeah, as you guys notice, I uh, kind of like switched my party because I'm kind of like leveling up my uh, new characters. I I got lucky. So <laughs> wait, this is a wicked meadow. Not the right spot. All right. So okay, Aki Adi Plateau is right here. So I'm gonna go to the Cat Daddy spot. And go. Mm -hmm. Inari, Ina Inari Plateau. All right, where do we have to go here? Uh, the bottom. Let's go down here and see what's up. All righty, people. They walk oh, here all the way straight from Izana. <gasps> Who is that? Yes. Hello. Those who give their all will be the one who receive the eternal blessing. Money keeps coming out of my pocket. <sighs> Aruki, my son, you've returned from the war. Are they saying something we don't? The hooded weirdo is making them sing things, I bet. Look closer, Aldo. Oh yeah, they're all being possessed. He's stealing their energy. What is he, a bad guy from Sailor Moon? <laughs> Not on my watch. You must be Akurau. What are you doing to these people? You. Interrupting my plan again, are we? Well, I won't let. Again? Wait! But I will save the fighting for later. I must regain my power first. You might not, but we're not letting you leave without giving back what you've stolen. Stolen? These people offered their life force to me willingly. It's just humans are quick to drown in their own desire. Giving them a sample of what they want and they give you everything from another taste. More and more money. Honey, you're back and you brought Tumba back with you. This is bad. We're getting weaker and weaker. Stop this. You're killing them. Five against one. Now, that's not fair at all, is it? Looks like I need to even the play field a bit. Money. Who stole my money? Huh? Hey, what do you think you guys are? Where are you guys? Where do you think you're taking my wife, huh? Hey, wait, we're not here to fight you. 
I was expecting more power from a group this size, but alas, I find s I'll find some other way. I knew it! The pretentious way you talk and that funky auras you have. You're that specter from that other day. What? Oh, he's kind of cool looking. There was something I wanted to ask you. You know, if I ever saw you again. How did you know how to find me? Did my parents tell you? What's the difference does it make? I have no further use for you. Hey. Sorry guys if the voices change between videos. <laughs> oh, alright, so they're safe, which is great. Hey, what am I doing here? I feel like I just woke up from a crazy dream. Uh. Hey, are you okay? Uh, it's weird. It's like I try to move, but I can't. I specters have been sucking out your energy. Best you just stand still. Till you regain your strength. What? Uh, these people are gonna need our help. Each of you, take someone. Yes, sir. Mione. No, Nekoko. We need you to go out and look for the specter. I don't know all the details, but you, we can't just leave him be. Thanks, Otanaya. I'll take along, Nikoko. But where did we even start? Oh, Nikoko, what brings you here? Granny Snack, you remember me? Yes, it seemed as if I wasn't a dream. We're looking for the Akura Akura guy. Any idea where he went? Where he might be? I believe he said something about the Spectre Palace at some point. Of course, the Spectre Palace. Thanks, Granny Snack. You okay? So, it was just a dream. Of course it was. There is no way he could come back. What a silly thing to dream. Granny Snack. If you're ever feeling lonely, you know you can always come to see me. Huh? You can't pat my head. I even let you grab in my tails anything you want. A granny site exclusive offer. It's the least I can do. I know, it's not the same. But I'm here for you. So keep that chin up. Thank you, Nikoko. Such a sweet child. I'll be sure to stop by the shrine. Snack and toe, of course. Can't wait. Now, I'm gonna go murder a specter. <laughs> that specter. He has no idea the pain he's caused. To, uh, he caused these people, showing them these impossible dream. He has no idea. You okay, Nikoko? To have this all be just a dream is cruel. Nyado, it's unbelievably cruel. We gotta find him. Yeah, alright, let's go. I mean, it's pretty easy. I'll just, it's right over there. I actually thought it was on the other side, but whatever. Alright. Alright, cool. So let's go to the, um, let's go to the, um, the, the, the Spectre's Palace, which is, where is it? Right here, Spectre's Palace. I'm not gonna walk all the way there, guys. Nope. Uh -oh. All right, Spectre's Palace. Here I come. All right, where is that dude? Oh, there you go. You should be here somewhere. Yeah, but with that palace this big, how do we find them? I should be able to sense his energy. 
and I'm getting something from the end of this hall. Nekoko? I won't let him get away. I won't let him get away this time. But something's about him. I'm scared. Of, I'm scared. Of, I'm kind of scared of fighting him. Why would you? Why would you be scared? Because no one knows how to find my. Because no one knows how to find me, and yet he did. The only person that knew was where that knew were my parents. Hmm. Which means they were probably the one that told them. They gave me up. Huh? Why would he do something like that? Because I'm a disappointment. Huh? You know the story about how I left. I was left at the Cantrine, right? Yeah, and then Yanjaro raised you, Nanjiro. They did that to protect me. If that's the case, why would they tell the guy where you were? My parents are on the run. My family, you see. We have a special power. Special power, huh? The power you mentioned before, right? Yeah, this power gets passed down in my family from generation to generation. And in the end of a bad specter, they could control an army. Which is why my power is kept in our family, as we are thought to use it for good. That's, uh, that's a lot on the shoulder. And so to keep that power from falling into the wrong hand, your parents gave you to the shrine. Yep. And ever since then, they've been on the run to keep the scent off, off me. Oh, to protect me. They risk everything for you. And what did I do with the time they gave me? Nothing. Huh? After all they went through, I never got the power. What do you mean? Oh, wait. I do remember you saying something about getting someone else's power or something like that. What power is it exactly? Where are you supposed to get this from? So many questions. You can legit manifest a giant cat to claw people while we fight. What more can you ask? You probably know better than I do. Me? Anyway, the fact of the matter is my parents told him where I was. They were probably so upset about how I wasted all this time they gave up trying to protect me. I'm just a stray, and who protects a stray? No, Nikoko, come, you know, calm down. I mean, you're kind of like overreacting here, girl. I'm in no place to say, but I know that can be true. You, you're not a stray. But I don't know your parents, but to hear you talk about yourself like that, well, it makes me sad to hear it. It makes Ota Otaha sad too. Makes everyone sad, Nico. Well, come on. You too. Finding out what really happened is totally up to you. But regardless what happened, there will be people at home waiting for you to come back. Meow, though. You're right. Can't let this stop me. The great Nikoko must press on. Meow, though. Let's find this Akurahu and make him tell us everything we know. All right, I'm gonna go murder a specter. The jizz is up, Akurau. Persistent little brat. To, to think I will have let you live if you could have just left well enough alone. And leave you to your evil device, no way. Now, tell us what you're planning to do with the power you stole from the people of Izana. I could have been anybody's power, honestly. I just need power so that I could make this palace my own. What do you mean? When Mizuchi disappeared, our power was greatly reduced. It caused a great panic in my people, which made it the perfect opportunity to seize control. What? But I do not have enough power just yet. 
as it, as I stand. I only have enough power to, to cast illusions. I need something bigger, stronger, or I'll never compare to the great specter in our clan. And that's why you wanted my power and the power of all these people? Yes, not like it work or anything, though. And it's all your fault. Everything. All because the power of the sacred beast lies not within you. Sacred beast? Huh? You mean you do you don't know? There's really they really told you nothing, huh? Your family has passed the power of the sacred beast down from generation to generation. You should at least know that. Okay, but why do you know that? I have my ways. Now, surely by now you have noticed. You're fallen right into my trap. Huh? Where did they come from? Be careful, Nikoko. An, an illusion of this size is hard to keep up. Let's make this quick, shall we? <clears throat> Nialdo! Oops. I must have used too much of my power here. It's important to take humans alive. What do you mean? You honestly think I'll let you walk in here without some kind of plan to stop you? I built this all just so I could trap you. Huh? And now that you're here, I can use as bait for as long as I want. I can then steal the powers from other Spectre to finally get what I deserve. Why would anyone come to find me if I don't have the power? That's just the thing, only I know you are powerless. You! That's quite enough, I think. I wasn't born just to be... just to become some stupid Spectre's bait. <laughs> Nikoko! <clears throat> Damn! You silly thing. Let your anger get the best of you and look what happened. Oh shit, that was a giant mistake. But I mustn't let you pull any more stunts. I can't move. But I... Nekoko. Huh? That voice. I know it's from somewhere. Of course you have. You remember us then. You were just a baby. Huh? Mom and Dad. We've come to get you, Nikoko. Yes, you've done well to come this far, all on your own. <gasps> How? What? What happened to Akurau, Nyaldo? Your, f your father got rid of all the bad men for you, Nikoko. Aldo is in some place nice and safe. <gasps> That's good to hear. My poor Nekoko, look what they've done to you. It's okay, Daddy's here for you. Mom, Dad, thank you for protecting me all these years. But there's something I need to I need to tell you. Is it about the sacred beast? We know the power was given to someone else. About someone else. What? To be honest, I'm glad it wasn't. It's such a Huge burden. <gasps> it has been the cause of great pain for our family. We're happy to be finally free of it. What's wrong, Nikoko? Who the hell are you? Your mother, of course. Whatever do you mean? 
You just don't remember what we look like. Hmm, a dream too good to be true. Perfectly tailored for me. You make no sense. The power of the sacred beast is a burden? My parents would never say that. I read that letter you left a million times over. I know the pain you felt when you let me at the shrine that day. But, but, but you had pride. The power of our family holds and the responsibility it brings. My father was, a, was proud to have it. You're a fake. A fake born from my guilt of not having the power and hoping from your for forgiveness. I just didn't want to admit it. Mikoko, not like I'm busy killing monsters. Save all the time that you need, girl. To break free of my spell on all your own. Impressive. Guess I have to do this, to do this the hard way. Mm. <gasps> but you're too valuable, perhaps. You haven't even seen a tenth of the percent of what I can do, but you're definitely about to find out. How could I get ready? Cause here's here comes of the beating of your life. All right, let's get this on with some cat hook. <laughs> Blue roses have thorns. Did you know? Bitch slapped by a cat. Love it. Ugh. I underestimated you for sure. It's not too late. If you join me now, I'll forgive you. If you let me your power, I... No way! And you sure have a big mouth for someone with so little power left. You got me there. What is it? Why, don't you... Why do you want power this much? Can you live in a happy life without all this? Why can you all why can you all just leave me alone? You're a specter, you should know. It's in your blood. Only the strong survive. This is how we live. And for the weakling like me, I have to fight even harder to survive. It sounds like a terrible way to live. It is tough. But aspiration is what drives us, and it's allowed me to see something truly great. Huh? Your power, Nikoko. I thought you were weak, like me. But I was wrong. Your power is great, but nothing compared to the sacred beast, not even a fraction of it. Whether it was your blood or your will that brought the power you do have, I do not know. You think I want this? Do you think I want your compliment? <clears throat> Allow me to leave you this something. How I was able to find you. <gasps> You'll tell me? I found your parents. It was a long time ago in a place quite far from here. They were under attack from other specter and I suppose they were weakened. But they fell for my illusion. You bitch. I showed them their greatest fear, and they scream your name. Nekoko! <gasps> they did? Like parents trying to save their child from imminent danger, they call out to you. That's how I knew they had given the power to someone else. And so you search for her. I took time, quite a long time. So they didn't give me up after all. Thanks for the tip, Akurao. I don't like you even a bit, but I'll let you live. You sure I might come for you again? Don't make me laugh. Even if you did, you'll think I'll lose no way. You are a weak little mouse compared to the great cat 
Nick Coco. Well, I'm glad we find out about your parents. Yeah, I'm happy to have the peace in of mine. Now, without it, the surprise though, you and your parents have been through a lot. Yeah, they swore to never see me again when they left me at that shrine. It wasn't a letter they wrote, spending the rest of their life on the run just to protect me. That's um, yeah, it's kind of sad. All I could, all, all so I could live my life in peace. I've got some growing up to do. Do you think I want him to forgive me? Hey, Nikoko, I could always said you were supposed to inherit the power of the sacred beast, right? But as far as I know, the power of the sacred beast was inherited by... Crap! Huh? We need to go check on the people you were sucking the power out of. We just left Ontaya there all alone. Oh, wow! I hope she's okay. Now, though, no time to waste. We need to go now. Now, now, now. You're right. Let's head back to, to Izana. Go, go, go. What a, what a good way to um, dodge the... Um, what a good way to dodge the attention. All right, let's go to the city, guys. I think that's the conclusion of the quest right here. Yep, it is, I think. It is, yeah. Oh, Tanya! There you are. All these people are here and doing fine. They just need a little rest and they'll be good as new. That's a relief. What happened to Akurai or whoever? Oh, that guy? He was no problem at all. All thanks to the great Nick Coco, of course. I beat the crap out of him. Yeah, good to hear. I bet Nyaji's message was about him. Now that you mention it, if the followers are in trouble, then the shrine is in trouble. Good things we took care of that. And I bet we'll start ranking in the cash too. Now, that's our followers are back. Good job, Nikoko. That's my girl. Boy, I'm pooped. I think I'm gonna need a piggyback cry back to the shrine. Huh? <gasps> What's that, Nikoko? You're acting a little like a little kitty again. No, 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 I'm not. <laughs> not like I not not like you don't always act like one anyway. No, I don't. Hmm. Hmm. Yep. Did something happen with Nikoko? Nikoko sometimes gets like this with Otawa. It's always when she's feeling lonely. Oh. I mean, she's been avoiding a bunch of stuff and I think she has a family issue, but you know, don't we all? I mean, it could be nothing. Sorry, I even brought it up. It were rules of me to ask. I'm going, I'm going head back everyone's tired so I'm gonna get a head start on the dinner lonely huh something's about Nikoko changing our fight that's for sure but if I but if what Nikoko said was true yeah though hello are you coming or what on my way the power of the sacred beast went to Altina not Nikoko so then, why is this all this happening? This is, this is a good question. Alright, so Nikoko's quest is done, I believe. Yes, part two is done. Wow, so honestly, um, it's actually really good. I'm actually happy. Um, a little review on the quest, guys. Not the most fighting heavy, but I do start to think of the character Nikoko better. Um, I mean, at first I thought she, she would be like the annoying cat girl from like every anime game ever but it seems like she's not she has way more depth which is pretty nice i'm actually i'm actually happy and i'm grabbing this guy back because he's one of my favorite 
Um, but yeah, guys, um, that being said, Nikoko Part 2 is done. I will try my best, guys, to upload more quests. Um, just because I really, really love this game, and this game needs more... This game needs more love, this game needs more player, these games deserve to be known guys, there's a lot of work put into it, there's a lot of, a lot of fine craft to it. This game deserves all the love guys. So that being said, that's gonna be it for today guys, and I'll see you guys next, next time. Bye bye!